The warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. The teams then, Roma against Marseille. I'm Peter Drury, and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Hi everyone, and thanks Peter, it's great to be on board. Look at them now. Got things on the way. Dzeko passes it through. Goal! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Yeah, I've got great admiration for the finish, but I've even more admiration for the pass that set it up. It was delicious. Roma take the early advantage. Checo with the ball through. Badimo. Alessandrini. De Rossi pulls off an exemplary piece of defending. from immediate danger. Salah. All this over the line. And that's been repelled. And scored inside the first ten minutes to give them a 1-0 lead. Mohamed Salah played out to the wing. He's dealt with that well. And the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Looks to slip it through. Fence has got rid of that. Alessandrini. Tries a through ball. Looks like a good ball through. It's the through ball. It's El Sharawi! Tremendous from El Sharawi! And with that goal comes comfort. And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned.
Roma have a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. That second goal is such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. It's gone for a throw-in. Now it's Diaby, chance to shoot, thrust towards the front line. Badimo, Alessandrini, where to from here? It's a long forward pass. Comes forwards, and the referee brings the first half to a close. Roma go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. Away again. Diaby. Alessandrini. He's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Looks to slip it through. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Bedimo is the route one option. There really wasn't very much in that, far away from being a telling final ball. I thought it was good vision, but the execution was poor. Roma with this two goal lead, They're certainly looking much the more assured side. And it's Alessandrini. Alessandrini. Floats one over. Balls over the line, and it is a corner. And it's been taken short. Alessandrini hit into the middle. Good delivery. No joy. And it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position, but quite a static defence was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode. It should have been much worse. Up he gets! Roma need to make a change here. Checo. Totti. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Oh, there were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. And it's Strutman. Played, he saw that coming. Alessandrini. Badimo. Now that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. And he's going to Rex. Well, technically, that was a beautifully struck shot from so far out, and I just thought he was a little unlucky then. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. Oh, good interception. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Dumps it on the volley! They are running riot! Unbelievable. And the lead is three! It is surely done! 
That is some volley. Great technique. Look, you can end up looking a bit silly if you don't make the right connection on the volley, but he met that cross perfectly. Roma take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Tries a through ball. Mohamed Salah cut out in the nick of time. And there goes the final whistle. Roma have won big and in style. Everything went for them, their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. Your final thoughts, Jim? Well, I think when you score with your first effort and goal, there's a good chance that things are uh, going to go your way for the rest of the game. And to be fair, they used the impetus it gave them to gain a level of control, and I think they went on and deserved to win. So, just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.